know. Hello, are you enjoying the food? You're so cute. do with you huh oh. hello everyone welcome back to my vlog today is going to be a video that is a little bit different because i am going to review my newest toy i got the pivo pod silver and i it's really cool i put my phone in it and it has a 360 degree rotation it has cool features where it can track my face or my body or even my horse so I got it to help me out with getting some footage of me riding even when I don't have any one to video so today's video is all about trying this guy out so to start some of the features I already talked about the artificial intelligence tracking of a human a human face or the horse um, the 360 degree swivel. Now it is Bluetooth enabled to, to connect to my phone. So any video or pictures that I take um, while the phone is connected to the Pivo, it will save in my phone. It has a little remote for starting and stopping the video as well as overriding the turning or the tracking features. So if it's tracking away from me, I can use the um, remote to turn it back. So let's dive in. You've been watching the video so far and all of it has been shot from the Pivo um, since I've been talking. And you can see um, I have it set on my face recognition and it keeps missing my face as I turn away from the camera. That's why it keeps jerking left and right and left and right. It's looking for me. It took me a while to figure that out, which is why you guys are probably going to get pretty dizzy throughout this video because there's a lot of searching for me here. Now, when I go in the indoor with blue to do some um, sort of liberty work, I do try setting it on the body mode and I do try setting it on the horse mode to see how well it tracks. I also did a lot of editing where it will turn and stare at, I think it looked at a hose at one point, it looked at the dusty barn aisle at another. I've edited all those pieces out because it makes the video pretty long and pretty boring. So that's also why you're gonna see a lot of jerkiness, but this is all the Pivo right now, sort of searching left, right, left, right, looking for me. Okay, so right now I'm gonna speed up the rest of this grooming process so that we can get into the indoor and check out how the Pivo works with tracking um, with more fast movement. Okay, so here Blue and I are in the indoor, and one feature I forgot to mention is the Pivo has up to a 3 meter or 45 foot range on it, so not super great. So if you're doing close ride buys, it's a little bit better for tracking. Here you can see um, Blue and I are doing some liberty walking and halting. Um, this boy will work. He'll basically do your taxes for sugar cubes. You'll see in a little bit that I will have to hold on to his halter at some point when we start trotting because I've run out of sugar cubes. And I don't know if this constitutes as liberty work or not, but we were having fun and we were trying the new camera. So right now it's tracking me pretty well. Um, it will lose me a few times. I've edited those out because it was pretty boring for you guys, but the automatic zoom feature is pretty cool. 
There may be a way to adjust the brightness on the computer or have it auto adjust for all the different changes in sunlight. I just haven't figured that out yet. Oh, you guys, look how sweet Blue is. He's got this pokey little trap, but he's trying to stay with me. So, I'm, okay, I'm gonna go ahead and speed up the video again so you can see how well it tracks us. I think I still, like I said, have it set on me instead of tracking the horse. Nope, maybe I have it on set to track the horse. Yep, I have it on setting to track the horse now. So I'm gonna speed it up so you guys can watch. So all in all, I'm not really sure how I feel about this little guy yet. It is my uh, first time out using the Pivo. I'm gonna do a couple more videos, see if I can get any better at it. I'll probably sit down and actually read the directions, but until next time guys, I hope you enjoyed.